Well, the day of the crepe is being celebrated in France today, but don't worry about missing out because our local restaurant has the sweet and savory treats and so much more. Yes, Chef Nathan and Chef Tucker are joining us from the crepe factory. It is the day of the crepe. And what, what is the day right, of the crepe? So the day of the crepe, <laughs> uh, it originated in uh, Brittany, France, the Brittany region of France. Okay. Um, it's mostly a French dish and uh, the best way to celebrate it is to just make it at home and mm -hmm. enjoy it with friends. Make it and eat it. They are delicious. Now, any secrets to making the perfect crepe? Because they're almost like really thin pancakes, right? Yeah. So what it is, is try to think of a pancake with a lot more eggs in it. So, oh, it, stays, okay. so it stays flatter. <laughs> okay. um, that's pretty much the best part of it. So uh, Nathan is showing off his skills over here. How do you keep it so thin, though? I know. The I'm eggs just make it really thin? Or? Oh, yes, that actually helps a lot. The butter keeps it down as well and makes it bind together. Uh, use the spreader so you can spread out the batter evenly as much as possible. Mm -hmm. And then after about 45 seconds, you want to get a nice spatula and try to break the surface without tearing it, which can always be tricky. <laughs> wow. So he mixed that together, he poured it on, you just spread it out, and you said the ingredients make it just spread nice yeah, and smooth. Yeah, so what it is is a lot of flour, uh, eggs, heavy cream, Ooh, butter, perfect. and a little bit of powdered sugar and vanilla. Now, do you need one of those machines there to make it, or can you do it like in a skillet at home? You know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> it is very possible with a nonstick skillet, but okay. it is better to have one of these flat top griddles just so you can spread it out more. Good deal. Now, tell us where you're located and what else you guys offer. All righty. So, we are located on 137 West Main Street uh, in downtown Spartanburg mm. at the uh, Morgan Square. Okay. okay. And we also offer more than just crepes. We have burgers, and we also have yeah. a lobster roll, which is... Really, I know, that looks so good. It's really, really good. <laughs> You've got to try it out. Yeah, so yeah. tell us about some of these dishes we have here. This is the burger. All right, so all our burgers are hand patted. Uh, okay. About eight ounces. They're hand patted, so it's an indirect science. Um, Yum. Our most popular dish is definitely, definitely the Henry. This uh, is the Henry right here. The right here, okay. and it's going to be a powdered sugar crepe served with our house-made jam and, okay. of course, maple syrup. Yum. And then this right here. If that is what we like to call the lobster roll or the bobster <laughs> roll after the guy that comes in and makes it. Uh, <laughs> the bobster roll. The lobster of rolls are delicious. Now, with the crepes, you can get those like kind of savory or you can get them sweet. Do you guys uh, offer both? Yes, we do. Okay. We actually take it both directions. We have a spring street, which is almost like a chicken pot pie. Hmm. And then we also have something like the Ezel, which is Nutella and strawberries and powdered sugar and a really traditional sweet way to serve it. And do you have to eat crepes like just for breakfast or can you just put them Honestly, dinner? Honestly, I think you can put crepes anywhere. Okay. Uh, <laughs> breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Okay, good deal. All right, and uh, Nathan, it looks like he's done over here, so what's the next step after this? Oh, pretty much done. Whatever you want yeah, to do with it. And then you... Plate and powdered sugar. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, do you put anything on the sugar. inside of it? You can. Uh, you can. Uh, Nutella. You can, uh, <laughs> yeah, you can put anything. Like, I like chicken salad inside mine. I'll wrap it up like a little... Oh, nice. You know, like a burrito oh. kind of thing, so... Okay. Yeah. You guys are fancy. I know, I know. I'm not super familiar with crepes, so this I'm yeah. actually yeah. learning a lot about this here today. We're going to come down and visit. we gotta, <laughs> so we got to come and visit. And yeah. I was looking at your guys' menu. The prices are very affordable, too. Good. I'm very glad. good prices. <laughs> I know. I was like, wow, I need to go there. Yeah, so well, for sure. Well, we'd love to have you visit. All right, so again, tell us where you're located. And All right, that's going to be 137 uh, West Main Street, uh, Morgan Square. And we look forward to having you. Please All come right. visit. They offer more than crepes. They've got the lobster rolls, the burgers, and you can have the crepes sweet or savory. Just yeah. come on out in Morgan Square. Awesome, awesome. All right. We look forward to having you. Thanks so much, guys. We really appreciate it. And we are going to take a live look outside before we head to a break. Looking at downtown Greenville through our city cam. Beautiful start of the day there, Jackie. Yeah, we're going to see uh, tracking 